Krishna. So I just want to explain why we haven't posted a video in a while. We've had a few updates and changes from Ranga Studios. Uh, most notably, we have two new teachers uh, and you can, you'll find out about them in the upcoming videos. We're going to release two videos after this um, very shortly and they're going to be, each of them are going to be featured in the videos uh, so you can see the skills they have. They're very great teachers. I'm very excited to have them on board. Uh, and and they're already, they already taken students. Uh, since, since the coronavirus and all this has been happening, we've had a huge influx of students. So just to deal with the capacity, I've, I've, I've recruited two new teachers uh, to help meet the demand. Um, but we're, you know, we're still here and um, we're here to serve you. And, and so here I, I wanna just get to it right away. I have a really great beat that I wanna show you guys that you can use in Kirtan. It's pretty simple. So if you're like an intermediate to advanced Maranga player, this, will, this beat will be very easy for you to learn. And again, the sheet music for this will be in the description below. Um, so this is a matan beat. It's a six beat, six or 12 beat. And uh, you play it typically at the end of the kirtan, when the kirtan is going really fast. And so this is very easy to play fast and it sounds really great. Okay, so I'm gonna play it really quick and I wanna see if you guys can figure it out before I show it to you, okay? Uh, before I break it down for you. So here we go. Here's how the beat goes. simple um, even though it might look complicated it's actually quite simple uh, so go ahead and pause and give it a try all right awesome so I hope you guys gave it a try uh, if you can figure it out um, if not here's how it goes right so if you look in the sheet music you will see That's the, that's the quarter of it. Uh, then, then the second quarter is um, K, all right? K is close. P, P is both sides together, closing the big side and three fingers. Na, K, P, Na. K, P, Na. Na is one finger. If you can look again in the sheet music, you can see the symbols and and um so that can help for you to learn it so and then the second half of this mantra is the very same thing but you play it reversed so whatever was closed now becomes open and whatever was open now becomes closed on the big side okay so the first half the second half gave that a try uh, and and I hope you kind of understand it now so now let's practice it together okay so here we go
fast there. Uh, but as you practice this, you will notice that it's quite easy to actually get fast. That's what's the, what, what's the beauty of this mantra. You know, that was what the speed we were playing at the end there. I hope you're able to play that fast. Maybe not right away, but you know, practice it more until you can get to that speed. But that speed is how fast you will, uh, as fast as you probably need it in Kirtan. You might go faster, right? Very rarely. So, so it's actually quite easy to, to, to play it quite very fast. So uh, definitely practice this up, be well prepared. As always, whenever you're going, to, uh, before you get into Kirtan, it's always good to practice a lot, you know, get, get a lot of practice before you start doing more and more Kirtan. So that you prepare for whatever comes, you know. I hope that was helpful. Hare Krishna.